So we're leaving Washington today. It is a stormy day and it was a little bit of a chaotic morning getting out. But tell from the video but the colors on the trees it just doesn't do it justice it is like beautiful and foggy and everything everything you can want I sent him to go get you, but he won't go get you. He's like, if I go over there, she's going to squeeze me tight. <laughs> over and around us lies, Lord of all to thee we raise. This our hymn of grateful praise. Are you happy about that blueberry biscuit? You look like it's a blueberry brisket. biscuit. It's not brisket, it's biscuit. Brisket. Brisket is meat. So we're heading down to Houston to do some paperwork before we head up to Kentucky for the holidays um, to visit with the family. And so right now we're heading down to California. Um, down to San Diego to visit with my sister who doesn't know that we're going to surprise her today. So hopefully we get to surprise her and uh, and she'll be in Del Mar for the Breeders' Cup horse races. She's a journalist. So it's exciting to get to see her. So cool. We just had a first. We just left our home at Costco because apparently Southern California does not believe in truck stops. Um, I spent the most time researching a gas station for us to fit into that I ever have our whole time RVing so far. And I could not find one single truck stop for our whole rig to fit into. So we found a Costco and thought, you know what, Costco might have diesel. We'll go there. Costco, in fact, did not have diesel. So we called up the Costco manager and like, hey, like, can we put down the RV here in the back of the parking lot for like five minutes while we go down the street and get diesel? They were super nice and said yes, but we just left our home at Costco. So it's better than like a mechanical issue, right? That's better. I was like saying, I was like praying over those mountains. I, we had to drive over more mountains today. Uh, that like we would not have any mechanical issues because we already blew a tire. Um, we already blew a tire going over mountains yesterday or the day before, whenever that was. Make so. a U-turn. Let's go. 
Costco. There's Costco. There's our home. <laughs> I was really nervous to leave it actually. There she is. So you go around this and to your right. There's the guy with the box with the uh, Yeah, what's his face? You having fun? Working? I think he was. I think he was on radio. We just happen to be in the area. So this is the spot that we got <laughs> to come visit Aunt Claire. You like it, Van? Watching the ducks? Yeah, the ducks, ducks. Duckies. That's so pretty. And the sunset, like. How about we go eat some dinner first? You want a burger? I want to go fishing it in and out. Yeah. There she comes. And we're going to guide her into the RV area so that she can come to visit. Are you excited to see her? Ah. You made it! I was like, do you have any more videos of Claire crying? <laughs> it's like, no, I turned it off as soon as she started crying, unfortunately. Oh, no. uh, I just got the beginning of you crying. Go over there and look at the bay where we're parked. Hannah, that sunset photo is so pretty. Adventure travelers, you guys have been so many exciting places. Can you believe that that actually worked out? That we no. were coming down here the same exact time? like. She bought pollen from the daisy and honey from the bees and seeds from the green grass and butter from the buttercup. Butter you want to read a book too? Do we show you the pages? From Portland to Reading, Reading to Hot Garbage Town, aka Fresno. Fresno it but like yeah, all the garbage. fires were burning in the Sequoia Forest, oh. and all the smoke was blowing. This morning we went through a mountain that the smoke was so dense that we literally like couldn't see like 10 feet in front of the yeah, car. Was like Hannah was driving, it was really bad. Wasn't like we also four? driving? Yeah, it was We tell if it was smoke or, or fog, but it was probably, um, it was probably smoke and yeah. fog. So anyway, we went from Fresno, when, uh, so we were in Reading when we talked, when I talked to Anne, because I was talking to Anna and Anna was like, where are you guys? Like, Claire's going to California today. I was like, really? I'm going to California too. Right. And uh, so I called Anne and you were like hanging out with Anne. We were so I was like, oh, it's a out. Christmas present. Yeah. And then she told me like all the details. But it was the same distance to go from, it was the same distance to go from Fresno to San Diego as it was to go to, from Fresno to Palm Springs. And then after this, we're going to Phoenix. It was the same distance to go from Palm Springs to Phoenix as it was to go from San Diego to Phoenix. Oh, so it didn't matter. So it didn't actually make any difference whatsoever. But we did, we blew out our tire, we blew out our tire in Reading yesterday. Yeah, I saw your post about that on your Instagram. I never crossed as much. Come on, Van! Come on, Van. Watch out. Don't knock him over. <laughs> Yay, Van. Go, go, Evie, go. He never crawls this much at all. So he was like. Go, Van. This is what happens when Dad keeps you out late. Gives you ice cream. 
Chipsia until 10 o'clock. You fall asleep with your cowboy boots on.